Is Donald Trump Hitler? If you listen to the vice president today, you might think so. But what does it even mean to be Hitler? You see, Hitler rose up because the country was in shambles. It truly was terrible. The economic outlook for many, many Germans was truly, truly, didn't really look that good. And uh, of course, there was a Jew hatred, which in every generation. So in, in that aspect, Donald Trump might actually be Hitler. We have a country that's failing for the past four years. People can't afford anything. Prices are through the roof. Crime is insane. Migrant, etc. Everything is just going bad. And uh, a Hitler could be someone who just comes and makes everything better. That is, the, if that was just the definition of Hitler, Donald Trump is currently Hitler. He is currently trying to run an election in a country that's currently being destroyed from the inside and trying to well, bring up the people. Now, rhetoric is everything, and that's where I think Hitler and Trump differ. You see, while um, Hitler went and said, your problems are the Jews, uh, Donald Trump not only didn't mention the Jews, but uh, he has Jewish grandchildren and a Jewish daughter, and uh, he supports the Jews. He literally goes to Jewish events like every other week. So in that, in that aspect, Donald Trump isn't Hitler. But there is one more that we didn't discuss. The migrants. Is Donald Trump the, is Donald Trump deporting millions of people Hitler-esque? The answer simply is no. It's not actually Hitler-esque to deport a bunch of people. That's what the government's job is to do. It literally says that in writing. The job of the government is to stop the border. If you cross over the border legally, it is a crime. And if you do a crime, you're not citizens of this country, we can deport you. And so it might look bad, but it isn't actually bad. Bad implementation can be Hitler-esque style, but that's only making assumptions of the future. And we don't actually know because we haven't dealt with a mass deportation of this this level, of this amount. Now, Hitler himself wanted to deport all the Jews to Palestine, as we know now, called Israel. He was a massive Zionist, trying to get the Jews to flee to Israel. Of course, the British stopped that, and then the Holocaust came afterwards. Yes. Hitler wanted to put the Jews in Palestine, and the British forced the Jews to stay in Germany. But there was no reason for the Jews to be forced out of Germany. They weren't committing any crimes. On the other hand, if you are an illegal migrant in the United States, by definition, you have committed a crime and a big one. You have uh, crossed our border illegally. You might be a terrorist. That's a huge crime. And therefore, it's very, very different. So to call Trump Hitler, well, the country might be in similar positions. And the actions might even be somewhat similar. But the intent behind it and the consequences and how it'll affect actual people varies very differently, differs very differently. It is just a totally different, completely different situation. There's also the fact that Kamala Harris uh, supports the people who support Hamas and are actively trying to get their vote. But that's a story for another day because. Uh... See you next video.